Wendy was able to introduce Matt to people he couldn't reach in England. But only a handful of them would appear on camera, including Mike Dunn, a TV producer who made a film about Gary's story, and actress Claudia Christian, who had been married to Gary for three years. Gary was a hothead politically. I mean, and he certainly had his opinions. I think he thought that everything was a giant chess play by, you know, the higher ups politically, that, that everyone was a scumbag to him. <laughs> you know, every president was a liar and every politician was an idiot. He was also kind of obsessed with, with he had buddies with the CIA and he, he was obsessed with the, the whole special access. Gary's writing a screenplay that involved the government. Um, you know, did he get information from sources, you know, within the, within the government and maybe somebody slipped him information he shouldn't have had and that's when he died. Writing and researching that particular story. When I first moved in with Gary, he said to me, don't be alarmed if you get a call from a person from a government agency. Just take their name down and their number and don't be worried about it. In the first four years, there were two calls. And then, not too long before he actually disappeared, there were several from the CIA at Langley. Gary was writing about CIA activity, US government activity, and he was taking a trip so that he could polish the script. And then he had an appointment to come back and turn it in. The last time I spoke to him was at about 1.15 in the morning. I said, I'll wait up for you. And he said, no, don't do that, which was really strange. And I said, Gary, are you all right? And he said, I am pumping pure adrenaline here. And I said, I said, what, are you okay? And he said, I'll see you later. I never heard from him again. <laughs>